and I'm here to do a Dollar Tree haul and I don't normally do Dollar Tree hauls but I thought that I would share this one because I am actually getting ready to go on retreat and I thought that I would share some of the things that I bought there because we're in a place where I don't know if we need to clean up after ourselves so I figured if I'm going to buy some supplies I may not use that the Dollar Tree will probably be a good place to use them and then I can just use them at home even though they're not my normal brand of product. So I got a lot to show you. I got bags starting here all the way to where you can't even see. So let's get started. So let me just scan and show you my bags first before I move them all out. I got one bag or a couple bags up there as well. So again, these products are going to be for retreat. They could be for gifts as well as products that we need to use while we're at retreat so keep that in mind as well the participants have to share two bathrooms and so i thought i wanted to make sure that i have some products for cleaning the bathroom so i bought this towel plus for the tub and then i also purchased shower cleaner for with the bubbles so that you don't have to do a whole lot of wiping to get the areas clean. Let me just slide those over that way. And then I also purchased a sponge to use for cleaning the bath area. And in addition to that, I got a bag of latex gloves. It has 10 gloves, so five pair. But if I'm cleaning the bathroom, I can just use one glove. And then I also purchased for each bathroom some air freshener. I got lavender scent. I do know some people may be allergic to various things. I'm hoping that those will work. Also for the bathrooms, I bought hand soap. I bought two of these. These are the foaming kind. And I actually, one for each bathroom and one also for the kitchen area to wash hands. And then I also purchased hand sanitizer for the kitchen area. Have some Dawn dishwashing detergent to wash up our dishes. And I purchased various spray bottles for water and spray sizing. Didn't know which ones will work, but I probably would just take these two since they're bigger than the other ones. Have one for water and one for spray sizing. I tend to buy all of my utensils from Sam's, but I don't buy knives because most of the meals that we have, we will not be needing a knife. So what I did was I just bought one pack of cutlery at the Dollar Tree, and then I will bring other forks and spoons that I have from home. For cleanup purposes, just in case we may need some storage bags, I have quart size bags here and then aluminum foil 40 feet and I have some hefty storage bags that are also a quart bag I mean quart size bags and I have two freezer storage bags that are 14 bags each and these are gallon size I got two rolls of paper towels and they are the one where you can do the custom sizing. I really didn't care about that. I just wanted to get as many sheets as I can get. And so I just brought two packages that will be used the entire five days. And I also have like napkins and plates and bowls that I also purchased from Sam's but that's not a Dollar Tree item and then I bought a 
package of paper bags and we'll use these for trash bags that we will tape onto our tables. I bought cleaning towels for the kitchen area. I bought two hand towels and one mitt to get things out of the microwave and also two microfiber scrub dish cloths that also have scrubby on one side microfiber on the other side so it was two in here so we can use those as needed <laughs> i also purchased straws and i know straws are very controversial but you may not want to put your mouth on a cup but I will be recommending that if they use straws, that they cut them into tiny pieces before discarding. I bought some storage containers that I'm going to be putting treats in. So it was four in one pack for a dollar. So I needed two packs for everyone at the retreat. And then I also purchased... 10 of these smaller containers that come in a package. These will also be for treats. And here is some of the treats that will go into the larger container. I bought two packages of Werther's Original Caramel Hard Candies. And then I also purchased two packages of Werther's Original Chewy Caramels. I also have bath sponges. And I bought a package of four in the event that someone forget theirs and then I can share it with them as well. And <laughs> some of these items now that I'm showing you are going to be gift items as well. I bought seven of the Gold Bond Ultimate Healing Aloe Lotion. And that's just to give them something in the work area to moisturize their hands after going to the restroom i only purchased two of the germex moisturizing aloe hand sanitizer these are to be used when we're out traveling and then we need to put some hand sanitizer on our hands other gift items is lint rollers so if they forget them at home i will be having one for them so everyone will get one of those have a package of Kleenex that everyone will get a package. And then I purchased some hair scrunchies. These are mostly for me, but if anyone else needs one, they're more than welcome to get them. I like these kind because they don't have the metal claps on the back. I also purchased me a shower cap. And something that the group can use when I'm on retreats, it just seems like someone always breaks a fingernail and they don't have a clip. So I brought a fingernail clip with some files, nail files, emery boards, and then I also purchased a toenail clipper. And the last item is I purchased cups for everyone. And I'm hoping that these will work for hot and cold. And then the lid just snaps down. And then it has room that you can also put a straw if you want. And the last item that I got for retreat at the Dollar Tree is some bags that will also be gifts for everyone that's there. So they had a few styles at the one that I went to. And then I went to a second Dollar Tree and they had maybe one or two more styles that I don't have here. But I really like this triangle patchwork. And I like this wild and free with the feathers as well. And then this is the last style here. This bag here. So I have enough bags for everyone at retreat. So that is it for my quick Dollar Tree haul for retreat. I just purchased one other item that will not go on retreat. But I also purchased this bowl. They had plates as well, other parts of this set. But I've been using these bowls and I like them when I'm um, using canned soup, progressive canned soup, that a whole entire can will fit in this bowl. So I like that. So I just purchased two of those. So, <laughs> that is it for the Dollar Tree haul. 
see back over there are books that I'm selling but everything here is all from the Dollar Tree so now I just need to pack this up and I'll be ready to go thank you all for watching that's it for this video and I'll see you next time bye bye